first has to do with diet um, in terms of making sure that things are moving well. I always focus on a diet that's high in fiber, making sure people get adequate water uh, during the day, you know, usually you know, up to a liter of water a day. And regular exercise is also, you know, it's very kind of trite and every doctor feels that they have to say it, but it happens to be true. For the gastrointestinal perspective, yeah, it just keeps things moving. In terms of general care also, one of the things we emphasize a lot is prevention. The screening age for colon cancer screening was lowered not that long ago to age 45, so we always recommend uh, people age 45 or older should get usually a screening colonoscopy. People with family history, other concerns, you know, potentially might be sooner, but that's, you know, that's a baseline. And then when it comes to upper digestive issues, you know, people with chronic acid reflux also may benefit from an upper endoscopy looking directly at the lining of the esophagus for prevention of esophageal cancer. So uh, oftentimes it's going to be red meat, uh, very spicy or acidic foods, excessive alcohol, so a drink or two uh, is, is okay, but more than that, you really want to be careful about that. Mm -hmm.